baba kwa jina la Yesu Kristo na kushukuru kwa sababu ya asubuhi hii na kwa sababu ni siku ni wikendi ya kwanza ya mwezi wa tisa na ulikuwa umetuahidi kwa mwezi wa tisa ni mwezi wa mabadiliko makubwa na kutakuwa na mambo mengi yatafanyika na kushukuru kwa sababu ya watoto wako ambao wamefika asubuhi hii na wengine wanaokuja naomba baraka itakayokuwa mahali hapa isiwapite pokea sifa na utukufu kwa jina la Yesu na tuseme amen Amen. Ninaomba tukae. Thank you very much. God bless you. Bwana Yesu apewe sifa. Muna furaha kwa mahali hapa siku ya leo. Ambia neiba karibu mwezi wa tisa. Na ujifungue ka kitu. Haleluya. Ombe hii tisa yote wezi ukabira kujifungua. <laughs> Amen. Aleluya. Naomba mwe makini kwa kinywa changu mupate ka kitu, mupate mbegu ya kusalisha mwezi huu. Aleluya. Mwe amen. Amen. Siku ya leo najua nimeona wale wale watu ambao ni wageni wageni unapoingia unaona watu wanaomba wakati mwingine unashindwa utaomba nini? Wewe endelea tu kusema asante Yesu, asante Yesu, asante Yesu, asa we unajua wakati mwingine unaangalia watu wanaoma wala baba unashindwa hasa mimi nita connect namna gani hakuna level ya maombi maombi ni sincerity hakuna usisema tu yule level yake iko juu level yangu iko chini prayer ya mtu level ya juu kabisa ya maombi ni kitu kinafanywa kutoka ndani ya moyo <laughs> unaweza ukaifanya kwa kikisi unaweza ukaifanya kwa kijaruo unaweza ukaifanya kwa lugha yoyote haleluya Yo kuna watu wengine wanaamini kwamba maombi ya kuomba kwa ndimi ndio maombi sincere. Hapana, hapana. Wewe omba kwa ile unaweza lakini omba kwa moyo. Unajua mambo ya kimbingu yanategemea moyo. Hata utoaji sio kiwango cha sadaka ni a cheerful giver. Bwana Yesu asifiwe. Kwa hiyo usi confuse kile unaona. Hiyo unaona we waachana nayo concentrate na yako. Naona mtu kama mimi wakati mwingine ninaweza omba maneno mawili ninyamaza niangalie waombeze kwa sababu mimi shughuli yangu ni kutoka moyoni amu kusikia hata Yesu alisema sio wingi wa maneno najua mimi ninaingianga hapa ninaangalia vile watu wengine mnaangalia unaangalia kidogo unaona wengine wanakaa sana alafu unaangalia eh na sichaendelea alafu nasema chisa chisa sijani You cannot all of you pray the same way. That you must agree. Kwa sababu kila mtu mahali umetoka, umetoka from a different orientation. Uh, we can't have the same way of <laughs> of realizing it. Wengine wamepokea Roho Mtakatifu, wengine hawachapokea. Mwingine amekuwa empowered kuomba, mwingine hajapokea. Na mwingine ameshachipiwa ame maombi yake, lakini kuna mwingine amekuja hapa ako na asira, anajaribu kulia. Na wewe unataka kulia au chui kinachofanya neiba analia. <laughs> Mwenzako hapa analia. Jesus kumbe yeye ni kutwangwa ametwangwa au chapiwa. Yeye analilia Yesu hapa. <laughs> Amuondolee shida. Na wewe uko hapo unafinya macho. No. Take it is when you come to the sanctuary connect with God as you. Waja kujaribu kukua photocopy hapa. You can't manage. You are as original as you are. Na Mungu anakuelewa vile uko hivyo. Na hiyo maombi yako kidogo ndiye atajibu. Bwana Yesu asifiwe. Eh mimi ninawaangalia wakati ninawahurumia nikipita pita hivi nasema mwingine anakaa maana maneno ya mei. Alafu anafikiria ndani yake anafikiria watu watanionaje unasimama. Na <laughs> alafu ukishasimama hakuna hata kitu unaongea. Na kusema Jesus alafu nasikiliza neighbor anasema in the name of Jesus na wewe una adapt hiyo in the name of Jesus in the name yeah, if it was a binguni kama sio original kutoka kwako unaweza ukaimitate but when you imitate you customize you know unaruhusiwa kuimitate but you can't imitate a miracle kwa mfano mtu amepokea muujiza ya kupata mimba you can't imitate the miracle or send it no it can't work Can, can you imitate that miracle? <laughs> Unaweza ukaiga character you can imitate something but unless you customize it iwe part of you it must be an integral part of your life that is how it can bear fruit but the moment you are just imitating copy ni copy 
Kuna kitu copy inakosanga seal. Copy ni copy si ndio? Eh copy hata kama inaonekana kama original, hata kama ni duplicate. Hata noti ya 1000 ukitoa photocopy, haita <laughs> utanunua na kitu. <laughs> Kwa sababu copy ni copy. So uh, my, my advice ni kwamba try to be as original as you can. If you can be able to imitate and then asa kama kuongea kwa ndimi, uta imitate mpaka wapi? Miaka ya nyuma kama atachachua mambo ya ndimi ni nini tukiingia kwa hiyo pentecote watu walikuwa natuambia sema ma ma ra ra ka ka. It doesn't work like that. If it is not given by God, don't struggle. Na sio kila watu wote wataongea kwa ndimi. Biblia inasema wengine watapewa kipango cha kuongea kwa ndimi, wengine watapewa hii. Sio kila mtu ataongea. Ati Mungu angojea kila mtu aongee kwa ndimi ndio amjibu. Si Mungu atangoja sana. Eh? <laughs> tuwe tuwe watu honest. Ile gift umepewa, use it. Why do you want to use what you don't have? Use what you have been given. Maana mwenye kupeana ndiye alijua nikipeana huyu hii itamsaidia nikipeana huyu hii itamsaidia maana Mungu hawezi akakupea kwa kujionyesha anakupea kwa sababu anajua itafanyika msaada kwako na kwa wengine Bwana Yesu asifiwe Haleluya Ni vizuri kwa sababu tunakuja hapa kanisani kupeana direction na kuelekezana si ati ni Mungu mmekuja niwapatie si hata mkiwa nyumbani mlikuwa na Mungu Eh ninakuja kuwafungulia kidogo mjue ndani kidogo kuhusu huyu Mungu na usifikirie unafanya mistake Bwana asifiwe